Hello YouTube, this is Morgan Airspeed Prime here with my next Avatar news update video. Uh, this video is going to be all about some more Zen Monkey Studios pins, um, so that's all we have to talk about today. But um, first up, uh, one that's actually on sale is this Avatar State Ang pin. This was sort of a surprise, I don't think they'd like officially announced that this was the next one that was going to be on sale, but it is available now. And uh, I suppose unfortunately I feel that this is the first kind of like dud that Zen Monkey Studios have had in that I just don't get at all what they were going for with the um, kind of colors, the, the the effect they were going for with, with just the the design of I think the colors because I actually really like the, um, the line art, the base kind of just Aang in the Avatar State design here um, but the colors just kind of baffle me while like there's just little bits of yellow all over Aang, why his like skin is a different color, why it overall seems to have this like effect of being like darker but he's in the avatar state and like there's glowing so like okay is it meant to be just that light contrast as a way to kind of make the glowing work a bit better but it makes just Aang himself outside of the the two white parts of him basically look sort of weird to me and and it's the exact same effect of like when we first saw the actual like official image that Angupans posted on Tumblr of like I didn't like it here um I could sort of see maybe the effect they were going for here but I think in the actual physical product um it looks a little bit darker than the actual art so um I think the effect kind of is even worse in the actual physical project product that came out. Now, of course, they also she also posted an image of this one for Korra, which, as I said at the time, I think this one works a little bit better. This one's not on sale yet. I assume it's coming soon. It works a little better, but it still, I think, suffers from the same problems of just like, why is the lighting effect blue when she's her eyes are glowing white? Um, I get sort of, you know, like... Blue is Korra's color, you know, sort of the, the yellowy orange is sort of Aang's color, but like, it, it's a hard to explain, like, why they decided that this was the lighting effect that they had to have for the Avatar State pins. Like, could they really not just have done a normal colored, like, Korra and Aang in these exact same poses, but just have them in the Avatar State and not have the weird glowy light effects on them, like this? Um, I feel they almost tried to do too much with this when I feel they should have been just a little bit more simplistic with it and I think that would have worked better. So for me this is definitely uh, probably the weakest pin that they've put out so far. Um, also you know just the description is a little weird of just like a power last seen by Master Roku. I was just kind of like that's really weird wording Master Roku. Again I, th I think Anne called him Master maybe one time or something like that. Um, but still like a power last seen by like no he will before I he was the last person to use the power like he saw himself in it uh, just the, the wording on that's a little weird um, the other thing here I want to point out as well is if you look at the picture uh, if you look where the cursor is here um, it looks like there's sort of damage on the one that they posted a picture of on their website it looks like something like crushed crushed this section of like Ang's arm because like there's all this white stuff and it doesn't look like like light kind of shining on it it looks like it's actually damaged and it seems to be the case because they posted a picture of the exact same pin it's a different picture on instagram but it seems to be like fixed here and it doesn't have that issue um so i don't know if that's just like a image mistake or maybe they happen to take a picture of one that was damaged or maybe it is just some sort of a weird lighting effect that they have on this um but it's something that like they'd want to maybe get consistent across all their like social medias and especially on their website um because that if people see that and think it's like a part of the pin that there's just this kind of weird white thing on his arm it could kind of i think you know distract people from maybe wanting to purchase it um so i get i get the feeling that uh, this could become like one of the sort of memes on my channel um sort of like how uh the other meme is also a kind of a merchandise product and it's the uh the sepia tone chibi ang repaint from zwire industries which is uh again one of the more baffling like color decisions made on an avatar product and it's all the more baffling because 
it seems like this was Wire Industries' last ever thing that they did because they're not making anything anymore. Um, so now it seems like we have two kind of product memes in the channel. One is just like, oh, the perfect repaint, sepia tone for some reason. And then the other meme that we have is like, oh yeah, when Ang goes into the avatar state, he starts to glow yellow in other parts of him and stuff like that. And Korra, of course, glows blue. Um, but, you know, that's just, uh, I suppose, poking a little. Having some fun at the expense of this pin, which I, I don't particularly like. I'm sure it'll sell okay. But this is, I think, definitely a case of, like, if this was coloured normally, I wonder how if the sales will be better than it actually is now. At the very least, I'd, I'd like an explanation for what the, like, artistic intent behind colouring it like this is. But uh, we'll move on to more positive things. Um... And that is, um, not that, um, this. Uh, so, once again, Angie Pants on Tumblr. The cool thing here is that Suki is going to be coming soon. So, this is what the physical version of the pin is going to look like. And they confirm here, sneak peek, finally ready for approval. She'll be ready for sale soon. Um, so, I assume this means, like, within the next, you know, couple of weeks. And I think this is one of their best looking pins. I think we've gone from probably their worst pin that they've done to one of their best. I think the art, just the line art looks so clean. And then the colors are bright and I think perfect for the design here of like Kyoshi Warrior Suki that they're going for. And obviously I think this is definitely one they've got a lot of fan suggestions for that Suki has to be included as part of the team. You have to do her as soon as possible. And I think they more or less said they kind of shot her up the list once they saw the, the feedback. So I hope once it goes on sale that it gets the sales that kind of uh, warrants them uh, putting the effort in to make it. I know for sure when this one is uh, goes live, I'm going to be putting in my next order. And I'm going to be getting this Suki and probably the Sokka. Um, but we'll have to see what other pins come out between then and now. Um, but yeah, I think it looks really, really nice. And you can see it is quite accurate to the initial kind of sketch that she did um so this is a huge positive thing like we basically don't have any suki merchandise and suki's become a big fan favorite character who's who's i suppose in the past couple of years like, like gained popularity but also been left out of things of just like she's a part of team avatar but she's often not included by like the creators in a lot of what team avatar does for very little reason and given no explanation almost that like the fans consider her part of the team avatar, but the creators don't. So it's cool that Suki's getting a pin and one of the best looking pins. So this is a big, big, big positive for me and um, that we have this. And then the final thing also from Angie Pans, this is something I actually missed um, a couple of weeks ago she posted this. I don't think it necessarily hints immediately towards pins, but just I suppose the designs of them and them not being full body sketches, it obviously hints towards some sense of um, there is some idea potentially within Zen Monkey of them wanting to do um, Day of Black Sun themed uh, Team Avatar characters. And so here's the, the rough, I suppose, sketches for um, the six kind of members of Team Avatar. I think the Katara um, looks very good because I'm not a fan of the current Katara they have. Uh, so I'd much prefer a book three Katara from later on in the series. And so if they did that pin, that would be my that'd be the Katara that I'd want to get. I think Sokka with his space sword, that's going to be a pretty popular one. Um, Suki without the makeup would be definitely be cool. Zuko with the swords. Uh, Toph in her, I suppose, uh, battle outfit is very good. And then um, kind of uh, Aang in his book three outfit is also an, another kind of very, very nice one. Um, so I think this is really, really good. And, and if they if they manage to do something like like release all of these roughly at the same time, um, I think these would sell very, very well as just a, a group, a very nice set that includes Suki. Um, and if they, I suppose, manage to include maybe an Azula in here along the way, they, they could do some good stuff for sure. But um, yeah, I suppose my final thoughts are just that um, with Zen Monkey, uh, the characters that I, I really want um, remain that for sure. Number one on top of that list, Avatar 1. I really want an Avatar 1 pin. They've sort of teased a lot of kind of concept art stuff and sketches for him. So it seems like they're working on it, but um, 
we've had we've seen no word i suppose immediately that he's going to be like released anytime soon or see any like confirmed design so i hope that get got, that gets fixed soon and we get a one um rava of course i'd love to see a solo rava pin it seems like it would fit perfectly just as a pin on its own because it's a kind of symbol almost like rava just looks like a symbol on its own so it would seem like a very easy to adapt kind of design um, similarly rava if you're going to do um Vatu, I suppose. If you're going to do Rava, why not do Vatu as well? Um, Azula, I think they have to do at some point, just because she, she kind of likes Suki, very fan favorite character, uh, is going to come back into the comics at some point. They they have to do her. Um, Tylee and May, I suppose, would be with the other characters they should, probably should do. Um, they've I think confirmed that the Korra villains are coming. I suppose we just haven't seen any word or like uh, designs for them just yet. Um, and I think for now, those are, I think, are the, some of the key ones they have to do. There's, of course, other characters like Jinora and so on who probably should get a pin at some point. But uh, for now, I think those are the definitely some of the main ones that they should do. So, uh, yeah, that's been the video. In the comments, let me know what your thoughts are. Um, do you get what they were going for with this Avatar State pin? How excited are you for the um, the Suki pin? Do you think it looks as good as I do? And just in general, what sort of Zen Monkey pins do you want to see? Um, and we'll have a little bit of a survey, I suppose, in the comments. But uh, yeah, that's been the video for today. Thanks for watching and bye.